is Pablo here. I'm a creator of uh, Mag Animator. Um, so you know now there is a Mag Animator version 5.1 out now. So if you're ready to update, just do it. There is some new features there. Um, there is some new items. Uh, very cool, um, cool items like hoodies, uh, lady t-shirts, and so on. So please go and check it out. But uh, this video is very, very short. But I would like to just point out one very major feature, which you've never seen it before. When you open your Mag Animator, and if you are a pro user, so if you have a key and you have a registered version, you will see this key which says "Create PDF." You, prob you probably wondered what, what it is. So here, here it is. This is the invoicing creator. It's very simple, very basic, but it gives you that ab ability for creating uh, invoices with the mockup already pasted in in the four different positions. So let's say let, I just I just quickly show you how 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 it works. So. When you start your Mag Animator version 5.1, you want to go to the um, to the gear icon, which is the settings. You just go there, place your company details, your name or whatever. So here we go. That's my that's my um, my initials, uh, contact, whatever whatever um, your phone number is. If you have your logo, you can add your logo here. Um, I'm gonna put something, you know, what, whatever. I'm not sure if you're gonna work that the artwork, but let, let's see. Let's try it. Um, your address of your company. So, so let's do something. Postcode, whatever, you know. You, you you know where you live. You know what to add there. If you have any term, terms and conditions of ordering with you, if you you know j j just place them here. And the currency you're dealing with. If you if you're dealing in the dollars, just put the dollars. If you in the pounds, put the pounds in. So here we go. Pound, euro, dollars. You know. Let's put the dollars here. And that's it. That's what you do. Nothing else. So just navigate back. And you're done. That will stay forever. That will stay forever until you want to change. If you want to change, just go back and change whatever you want. You know, just let's say uh, you want to change the post code or something for a different number. Um, okay. So now you're ready to do your first invoice. So pick your item. I like my hoodie. Here we go. Let's say you do sublimation hoodie. Do the white. I like to pick my backgrounds so it looks better. Pick the color of your hoodie. Here we go. I'm not sure if you check this uh, new feature out. You probably notice the pencil, or when you click it, you can pick whichever color you like. So this is the color picker. So if there is no color in the color uh, palette, if there is any specific color you would like, you can find it here. You have a whole spectrum of the colors that human eye can see. So help yourself and pick something. At the moment, I'm going to use the white, which is sublimation hoodie. Okay, put some artwork on it to show you. Here we go. I love my zombies. Here we go. Just put it just below, just above the pocket. I don't know if you see this. Um, um, mockup is great. Can you see the strings? The artwork actually showing behind the strings, so it looks more realistic. Okay, on the back, I'm going to put the different zombie. Okay, here we go. This is the back, and it's under the hoodie, so it looks more realistic. Okay, let's do it this way. Here we go. So hoodie is ready. So now what you're doing? Now, now what you want to do with, with the invoicing, you just need to click Create PDF. So check out what's going to happen. It's going to, you're going to see four times savings. Look, one, two, three, and four. 
Oh, it's free now. Okay, you show free. Never mind. And here it is the PDF you want to fill out. This is the information of your customer. So the person who you send in a bill to. Okay, your customer, let's say, is called, I don't know, uh, let's say he's a John Smith, his company name is, if he's a company or private person, you don't need to fill out all the, all the, all the spacing, but you can if you want to. So company, let's say, um, uh, I don't know. His address, whatever you want. Just any address. Obviously, this is just to show you what you can do. You fill out the spaces with the correct details, his contact number, his postcode, and obviously email. And this is the name of your product. Obviously, we're doing a hoodie. We're doing a hoodie. Um, a, um, we're selling a hoodie now with the two zombies. So, what's the product name? Product name is uh, zombie hoodie. Or you can, or you can just call it custom printed hoodie. What's the product price? I don't know what you're pricing your product. Let's say you're price, pricing it for the $30 uh, a pop. So one hoodie is uh, $40. Do you, do you charge for artwork for the origination? You should. Do. If you don't, that's fine. If you do, let's say whatever price you want. Let's say $50 for, for the artwork. And the quantity of the hoodies, how many you sold. Let's say we sold 14 hoodies product size you can add you know two times large three times extra large and so on blah 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 other info if there is any other info I don't know you know put whatever you like payment info PIPO PIPO to an email oh caps lock And whatever email you like any special notes for the customer you can add them here you can do your ordering number if you like just do it yeah and then once it's ready just click print the window will show up and you can do you can save it on your hard drive it takes literally just a second literally just a second that's all that's done now okay so Let's navigate the to the bill and check it out. And this is what you get in the new feature. Here we go. This is this is the this is where you're supposed to be your logo. I just put the zombie just you know to show you that something can be there. there this will be your address and this will be your customer address. This is the pricing: thirty dollars per hoodie, fifteen dollars per origination some of the info quantity and this is the total four hundred thirty five dollars and look down let's go down let's go down and this is what the customer see this is the best feature you can actually see four different views of your of your item this is huge so the customers love to see what they receive remember what it doesn't matter how simple it is they will love to see what they what they get in um, so if you have a terms and condition you can add them here so as you can see it's very basic very simple but now you can send it to the customer and look much more professional and uh, they can actually see what they're paying for and they keep it on the file so um so i hope you like this new future please uh, let me know what you think about this and um if there is any improvements i can i can always help um if this is an overkill please do let me know i can remove it you know I thought you're gonna like it so thanks for watching and please do let me know all the best friends